सो हे गाइड्स वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल फॉर डिटेल्स सो गाइज टूडे आई क्रिएट न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ साइंस फिक्शन सीन विद यूजिंग ब्लैंडर एंड गाइज आई यूज ई वी रैंडर सी गाइज दैट्स माई फाइनल प्रोजेक्ट गाइज आई टीच यू हाउ आई क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ कंपोजिशन दैट्स रियली कूल राइट एंड गाइज कैमरा अनचेक सी गाइज दैट्स माई सिंपल कंपोजिशन इट्स रियली ब्यूटिफुल सी Guys, that's my JS displacement texture, and second one dotted grid, right? Okay, so now, guys, I create this type of composition. So, guys, create new composition, and yeah, so select, guys, delete, yeah, and now, guys, I'm going to take a cylinder, and guys, change cylinder rotation like ninety. Yeah, and guys, see that's my vertex. Guys, I take like seven. Yeah, and guys, increase the size radius. Like guys, randomly like eight is good. Like eight, and depth this one increase. Guys, depth I like thirty. Yeah, much better, right? Okay, so now. Guys, go to on edit mode. Select this face, this one, this one. Delete and delete face. Select this one and press delete. Yeah. See, guys, that's my simple object. And next one, guys. Again, press A and right click, subdivide it. And number of cuts, guys, increase like this. And one more time, subdivide it. Like five is good. So guys, go to on object mode. Yeah, guys, go to on wireframe. Yes. See guys, that's my object. And now, guys, I apply subdivided subdivision. This one subdivision surface check. And guys, render I like five. And viewport level like four is good. Four. Okay. So guys, next one. I apply displacement effect. So guys, again go to on add modifier and this time displacement this one. Yeah. And now guys go to on new. Click on new and guys I apply JS displacement texture. So go to on here texture property and open texture. Guys, I show you my texture. See guys, that's my JS displacement texture. Right? this one and next one guys that's my dotted grid texture guys i show you my software see guys that's my just displacement click on here and generate your texture like this and second one dotted grid texture and generate yeah okay so guys i already save this texture and apply on here so open and guys go to on here and apply texture like this yeah see guys that's my texture but guys see that's not correct so i change guys uv and mapping so go to on here that's my mapping this one so mapping i like 3 and y axis 3 guys that's my uv so guys again go to on here modify property and see guys that's my coordinate so use uv yeah see guys that's my displacement texture it's really good guys little bit increase this strength like two is good for me yeah see right see it's really good but guys i don't like two so strength one is good okay so next one guys I apply one more this one sphere. So guys, copy, press Control C and V. Yeah, and guys, select your cylinder one, this one, and delete your subdivided subdivision and displacement delete. Yes, and guys, I change this size, create shape like this. One more time, guys, closer. that's for my lighting yeah little bit more yeah okay 
so now guys i apply array effect so use array and count guys i like three and z1 position increase this one yeah so guys go to on here yes and guys little bit smaller so press s letter yes right see guys that's really good guys size i like 15 is good and now guys i take one more light so press ctrl c and v go on here yeah that's my first one that's my second one and yeah all is good okay so guys now i take camera so go to on add and camera check yeah and guys camera so 90 0 and 0 yes and why it says change so press 0 yeah see guys that's my camera and guys little bit back yeah and guys also change this one focal length focal length i like 35 yes and guys camera go to one closer yes good okay see guys that's my camera angle it's really good and next one guys i apply cylinder for all corners so use cylinder yeah and guys vertex like 100 and radius guys 0 0.05 yeah and depth yeah 30 is good and guys rotate rotate this one 90 yes okay so guys now apply this cylinder all all corners so press 0 select and apply on corner so press 1 like this 0 yeah good and guys duplicate the cylinder press ctrl c and v go on here yeah and guys again duplicate apply on this side and one more time duplicate yeah so press 0 yes see guys that's my simple composition and next one guys i apply 3d model so guys i have 3d model so import and go to an xbx file this one guys you can download 3d model and all assets from my website it's free so go to on here model see guys that's my 3d astronaut model so set on here yeah and increase scale size so press s letter increase yeah and go to down press one guys attach on here on this one plane so closer yes right see guys that's my 3d character model so go to on back here yeah and rotate guys rotation like this like 180 degree yeah and guys little bit increase size increase yeah and again press one guys set on flow yeah so press zero yes and guys go to on here yes much better see guys that's my 3d character model and now next one guys i apply spaceship so go to on again one more time file import and fbx file so select Guys, select your spaceship this one and guys change position press 0 and rotation change guys rotation like this randomly yeah and closer and guys now i increase size size like this yeah see guys that's my spaceship and next one guys duplicate this spaceship select and hierarchy and press ctrl c and v so guys go to back yeah and press zero guys scale size change and guys also rotation change yeah great right see guys that's my simple composition 
and guys wireframe uncheck yeah so press zero yes see guys that's my beautiful composition right and now guys i take plane for background so plane check and scale size plane increase like 20 is good and rotation change yes so go to on here press zero guys scale size change plane scale size yeah yes okay so guys see that's my final composition right that's really good and next one guys i apply material and texture so guys select this one so i go to on here shading guys i apply simple texture so go to on here and guys select your this one displacement and press new i create new texture and guys go to on guys guys color i change like black yeah and guys metallic like 0.5 yes and roughness 0.4 yes guys metallic little bit increase like 0.7 yeah okay so now guys i apply dotted grid texture on this one so guys select this one principal bdsf and press control t yeah see guys that's my mapping at texture coordinate so guys it's link on base color so unlink yes and guys go to on texture image texture and apply dotted grid texture this one and open image yeah and guys also apply color ramp color ramp yeah and guys select this texture connect with color ramp and this color ramp connect with emulsion yeah okay so see guys that's my grid and now guys i change color so select on white color guys i apply orange color that's my orange color yeah and guys position that's my for lighting yes okay so guys also all is good and apply guys i change scale size so like scale size change yes see guys that's really good that's my beautiful lighting and guys apply more like 10 and 10 yes and press zero yeah see guys that's my beautiful texture dotted grid texture right and guys you can increase also emission strength like 20 for lighting yes really good right see guys that's my dotted grid texture it's really good great okay so now guys i apply texture for this one 3d character model so new and guys i take white color metallic increase like this and roughness yeah great and guys select this one create new base color like dark yes see guys that's my gloves that's my material and apply black material and guys go to on shoes so guys select this one shoes and apply black material simple right it's really good okay so now next one guys that's my spaceship this one and apply material so guys spaceship layer go to a mesh see guys that's my first one and yes first one guys i take like black color black and metallic little bit increase like this yeah and second one guys that's my outer material so that's my emission yeah and emission color guys take anything but i like orange 0 0.0425 to 4 and 1 and strength i like 50 yes much better right okay so guys go to on here and render engine guys i use ev render and guys ambient occlusion check bloom power check 
new power yeah and guys screen spacing check yes see guys that's my beautiful composition right okay so guys now i apply material for this one cylinder and create new material guys i use simple emission color yeah and color i like blue color 0.6 and 1 and strength i like 50 yes really good and same on here i like this one blue so guys i take one more color and guys i like orange color this actually red color red and strength i like 50 yeah so guys select this one and apply yeah great right see guys that's really good and press zero yeah and guys go to on here array and apply orange like this and apply you can up also apply blue also good right see guys that's my beautiful composition right okay so guys now lastly actually not lastly select this one and guys create new and apply simple texture so select this principle and press ctrl t guys i apply galaxy texture so open and guys i have galaxy texture this one actually that's my earth texture yeah beautiful guys right see that's my beautiful texture right see okay so guys also apply this one color so guys go to on galaxy shape spaceship select and mesh select first one and guys color black and second one emission yeah and guys color i like blue i like one and strength i like 50 yes see guys that's really good that's my final composition right and lighting is really beautiful guys okay so guys again i go to on layout and save your project like this and guys now i apply area light so light area light yeah and guys rotation change rotation change yes and guys radius i like 10 yeah and guys power i like 1000 so go to on here so go to on here close up press zero yes see guys that's really good that's my beautiful composition so same like this my final render and guys render like 128 and viewport is good okay so guys now you can also increase this intensity is depend on your work intensity increase lighting intensity so guys go to on view and intensity like 0 0.8 actually 0 0.08 yeah really good right see guys that's really good and guys i show you my final render see guys that's my final render it's really good same like this okay so guys that's it that's my final tutorial is finished it's really beautiful right so guys if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you